The time is 9.20 p.m. August 9th, Friday. What a night. Um, year 2024. Uh, so today I was hit with lethal chemical military grade gas. Tres. Three times. Dos of those times I had to race to the bathroom. Sick as a dog. Out of nowhere. Just... Oh, uh, and just peepooing. The first time was about the time I believe that letter was stuck with uh, twist ties, like you get when you undo a bread, a loaf of bread from the grocery store. They saved the twist ties from their bread loaves. They're still on the door. I'll take pictures of that. Um, they hung up the uh, bag with the twist ties. It, it was it, it literally done with twist ties from someone's kitchen. They saved from their bread they bought from QVC. And um, it was left on my door. Uh, this is a, an attorney. No, it's not. No state bar is going to locate that attorney. If a state bar locates that attorney, that attorney will be arrested and put in federal prison. But thanks for the letter. Thanks for the evidence. Um, the first time I was hit with really serious U.S. Navy military grade gas, chemical gas. That's what I call it. I allege it's U.S. Navy manufactured U.S. chemical gas. It's military grade. There's no question about that. I was just sitting here minding my P's and Q's in my uh, main room. I got so sick of uh, everything that I've described uh, with that really evil, nothing but lethal uh, chemical gas. Uh, I just went to the bathroom and it just poured out of me. That was about 2.33 in the afternoon out of the bl clear blue sky out of nowhere. Just pours all this diary out, just pee poo, just gushing out. I was so sick. And it's, it's like I have testified. There's nothing you can describe it to but pure poison. There is nothing I've ever experienced in my life that scary and painful. So that happened around 2.33. And then when I went to get this at 5.45, 6 o'clock downstairs, <clears throat> as soon as I was walking up the stairs, I got hit with chemical military grade lethal gas. They poisoned me for picking up the letter. And I had, I was pissed, because I was just fine. And I had been out of my room moving around for the 10 minutes. It wasn't until I picked up that letter, opened the door, grabbed that, and picked up today's mail, which was Comcast cable bill. The house has full Wi-Fi running, full business class cable like full spectrum tv running is all going here i'll put that up if i get the green light today's mail everything's going here phone lines everything's going get the bills for it coming in all these different names all these dead people still getting mail here all these dead people still getting utility bills here every month um i was about up to step four going up after grabbing retrieving this uh letter and um i'm buckling over i know i'm being hit like bamboozled with chemical military grade gas no question about that I was so pissed, I'm like, they're gassing me for picking up the letter. What kind of crackheads am I dealing with? So I had to go straight to the bathroom again. 
with the letter I put outside on my washing machine, outside, beside the bathroom, um, people went away just for picking up the letter. Um, I'm not going to make any statements or comments about my actions pertaining to this letter. I'm not going to make any statements or comments of my opinions or thoughts pertaining to this letter. All I'm instructed to do is put the lovely letter up. No statements, no comments. Coming from the witness to domestic terrorism and coming from the witness to ISIS, foreign terrorism, located at 1509 S Street Northwest. To be clear with full di disclosure, full dis disclosure, I, Heidi Granger, am the witness, a primary witness to this terrorism, violent, unforgettable, horrifying terrorism that takes place in the property of 1509 S Street Northwest, Washington, D.C. I, Heidi Granger, was hit again today sporadically once in the afternoon once in the early evening with chemical military grade lethal gas adios